So okay, uh, you tak share kakak apa. Nanti aku tengok dekat sini ada kakak tabula. Hi and Assalamualaikum. Today I and my team will be making a video presentation about health conscious market. First of all, let me introduce myself. My name is Nur Dayana Karmila binti SD Muhammad Jamuri. And my metric number is 17-F19F2084. Nice to meet you. Hi, uh, my name is Saratul Hassanah binti Roslan and my number metric is 17-F19F2082. Hi, my name is Hurun Ayy binti Mama Azli and my message number is 17-DHF19F2069. Okay, for next slide is about um, introduction. Health consciousness corresponds to self-awareness about one health and the willingness to engage in health and wellness pro promoting behavior, not surprisingly. Health conscious individuals actively seek for information about how to improve their health and adhere accordingly. Hence, individuals with high health consciousness have positive attitude about nutrition, self-care and exercise and accordingly have helped their lifestyle than individuals with low health consciousness. Such healthy their lifestyle also include frequently visiting a primary doctor and having a lower propensity to engage in perception drug misuse. Okay, for the next slide, I select for next topic is about lecithin in the product. Lecithin is a mixture of fat that are anxious nail to sell in the human body. It can be found in many food, including soya beans and egg yolks. In the diet, lecithin is the main source of choline, a nutrient like the B vitamins. People use lecithin for eczema disease and dementia, Parkinson disease and many other conditions. Okay, this is example um, product using lecithin for main source. The first picture is Amway product. The second picture is Black Morris. And, and the last picture is Shakli product. Okay, for the next slide. Uh, next slide about the benefit of, of lecithin. Okay, number one is cholesterol reduction. Research, research, research have discovered that soya bean lecithin can contribute to raising HDL or good cholesterol and lowering LDL or bad cholesterol in blood profile. Number two, help improve dige digestion. Lecithin improves fine quality, contribute to a chain reaction that improve the mucus in your intestine, making the digestive process easier and protecting the delicate lining of your digestive system. Number three, improve health health. Heart health. I'm sorry. The citin that come from soy can improve cardiovascular health, especially if you are already at risk of developing high blood pressure or health disease. Number four, may fight dementia symptoms. The citin contains choline, which is a chemical that your brain uses to communicate. A diet rich in choline can lead to sharp memory and help people with Alzheimer's. And the last one is soot and moisturizer skin. The citin is in the ingredient of some skincare products. It is used as a emulin, making skin feel smooth by restoring hydration. Okay, so for the next slide, uh, is that all for me? Next, I will give this slide to the next presenter. Thank you. Hello, uh, my name is Rauda. Yeah, I want to continue present about issue on obesity. Today, uh, nation was country who highest obese. Nation has many food who more unhealthy food compared to healthy food. 
for for issue on obesity is 13.5% of Malaysia becoming obese, the highest among Southern Asian countries. UNICEF survey, 12.7% uh, of Malaysian children aged 5 to 19 years old are obese, the second highest in Southern Asia behind Brunei. More alarming is that 7.1% of overweight Malaysian children are under the age of 5. 70, uh, 73% of that in Malaysian government hospital are due to obesity related and healthy issue. For the next slide. Okay. For the next slide is about statistic of obesity. For the childhood, the prevalence of childhood obesity, children under uh, 18, 18 years old increased from 6.1 to 11.9 percent percent between 2011 and 2015, and hit all the time higher high of 14.8 uh, percent in 2019, according to the National Health and Morbidity Morbidity Survey and HMS. For the adult. According to the 2020 study, an esti estimate 54.2% of Malaysian adult population in overweight of obese, of, of, or obese sorry, an increase of 4 percentage points from the finding of the National Health and Morbidity Survey and HMS in 2019. For the next slide. Okay, and for the next slide is about awareness about obesity. Word of obesity day. Firstly, increase awareness. Obesity is a disease. We, we are raising awareness and improving understanding of its roots, causes, and the action need to address them. them. Second, encourage advocacy. advocacy. Changing the way obesity is addressed across society. We are encouraging people to become advocate, standing up and, and calling for change. For the number three, improve policy. Creating a healthy environment that pre prioritizes obesity as a health issue. We are working to change policy to build the right support system for the future. And the last one is share experience. Stronger together, we are creating a platform to share experience, inspiring and uniting a global community to work toward, to work toward our common goals. Uh, that's all for my slide for the next presenter. Thank you. Hi, my name is Hurun and I will uh, discussing about this slide about obesity health conscious. So why we uh, choose obesity as our disease because our product is lecithin and as Diana said earlier, uh, lecithin can help with uh, uh, losing weight. So uh, these are things you can do to prevent obesity. Okay, number one, exercise regularly. Uh, for example, uh, the easiest uh, way is uh, 10,000 steps a day which is uh, you can uh, walk uh, on the park or uh, while uh, hearing, uh, listening to music. Then um, you can exercise three times a week at least. Uh, yeah, uh, just stay active uh, and we can count it as exercise. Uh, second, take small amount of food at every meal. Like uh, we can see on the picture there, um, uh, they put quarter of protein, quarter of grains or carbs, and half of uh, vegetable and fruits. The third picture, uh, the third, uh, eat when you are hungry and stop before you full. Like uh, we as a Muslim, they, we have this sunnah, which is our Prophet Muhammad, they uh, eat when you're hungry and stop before you full. We can uh, 
do that uh, in our lifestyle. Uh, okay, the uh, fourth uh, picture. Avoid high sugar and high fat diet. Uh, like on the picture, like donuts, sodas, and other uh, apa and sugar, a uh, high high sugar and high fat uh, food. So we have to avoid it. Um, not uh, not uh, stop it uh, immediately. Just take a little bit, uh, maybe like once a week for a cheat day. Uh, and the next uh, picture is drink enough water at least eight glasses per day. Eight glasses, eight glasses per day equals to two liters uh, a day. And the last one is avoid taking heavy meals before sleep or late night. Okay, next slide. Okay, uh, the conclusion. Okay, being healthy should be part of our overall, overall lifestyle. Living a healthy lifestyle can help prevent chronic diseases and long-term illness. Feeling good about yourself and taking care of your health are important for self-esteem and self-image. Uh, main Maintain a healthy lifestyle by doing what is right for your body. Body. Obesity is something that increasingly on the rise today. Yeah, on Malaysia, uh, uh, on just on Southeast Asia, Malaysia uh, is uh, the second place uh, the, uh, before Brunei for the most uh, obese uh, citizen. Uh, and today, and we'll continue to rise unless we do something about it, like informing people of how bad it really is and encouraging people to live a healthy and enchanting lifestyle. That's all for me. Thank you.